Thank you for tuning in to Alert Culture. Now, if you've ever thought of or started a new YouTube channel, you already know. So please subscribe to our channel and give this video a like. We appreciate your support. The Office was an American mockumentary comedy television series that depicts the everyday lives of office employees in the Scranton, Pennsylvania branch of the fictional Dunder Mifflin Paper Company. To simulate the look of an actual documentary, it was filmed in a single camera setup without a studio audience or a laugh track. A camera crew has decided to film Dunder Mifflin and his employees seemingly around the clock. So it's basically like a fake TV show documentary type of deal. In 2005, Steve Carell signed a seven-year deal with NBC to star in The Office, which was a remake of the British TV series of the same name. Carell starred as Michael Scott, the regional manager of the Dunder Mifflin Scranton branch. Scott was a well-intentioned man whose attempts at humor, while seemingly innocent to himself, often offend and annoy his peers and employees. And in some situations, they actually lead to him getting reprimanded from his supervisors. The Office was met with mixed reviews during its short first season. But as the second season started, the success of Carell's summer hit movie, The 40-Year-Old Virgin, and the online sales of episodes at iTunes helped the show tremendously. Steve was reportedly paid $175,000 per episode starting in the third season. Now, that was twice his salary from the previous two seasons. Steve Carell was nominated for six Emmys as his role as Michael Scott, but many of the cast and crew members have expressed anger that Carell did not actually receive an Emmy Award. Despite this, Carell did end up winning a Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in Television Comedy or Musical in 2006. On April 29, 2010, Carell stated that he would be leaving the show when his contract expired at the end of the seven years because he wanted to focus on his film career and he also felt he was at the height of his success with the show and he wanted to leave out on a good note and pursue other opportunities. Later seasons were criticized for decline in quality, with many seeing Carell's departure as a contributing factor. However, the final season ended the series run with a very positive response. Now, why are you leaving your show? What? I, what? <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? I really want to spend some more time with my family. That's... I, <laughs> I don't know how that gets Can we do that? Honor my contract. Did you know about this, John? <laughs> it's the first time you Does he have a family? Does he have a family? It wasn't an easy decision to make, but I just feel like now's the time. And I actually think it'll be good for the show in the long run. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in to Alert Culture. What do you think about Steve Carell leaving in the last season? Please drop your comments below. We read everyone. If you have any video ideas, Please also drop them below as well. Give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe.